peace infinite waters diving deep once again rich filthy rich wealthy poor all of these terms people would define to label our status and a lot of the time when we talk of money money some people say money makes the world go round and if you ain't if you haven't got money then i don't want to hear what you have to say a lot of us when we talk of rags to riches many of us we use money to give ourselves value in life and on my journey i realized this was not the correct thing to do at all because essentially we have to give value to ourselves i've had no money i've had a lot of money and when you realize that essentially money is a man-made concept many of us we feel that money is the only way when in essence that's not true because eons ago there was no money but we survived so how how did that happen when we talk of money being engineered because essentially money is currency so we are currency so the more currency we have which is in essence the more energy we have that means the more money we have so all we need is health is money health is wealth so essentially the millionaires in the world the billionaires what's more important their money or their health well what comes first if they don't have their health then they don't have their money so essentially people should always be recognizing the health that they have they are actually walking billionaires if i was to ask you can i buy your teeth off you for a million pounds how many of you would how many of you would sell me your teeth <laughs> how many of you would sell me your eyes for a billion dollars so that just shows you that you are walking billionaire and for me i've just realized that we have to money does not bring happiness money is just a means but essentially it's not the end and it's about looking at things in an abundant way for me on my journey to realize that abundance is our natural birthplace and yes you can have the finer things in life have the best clothes eat in the best restaurants have because we are gods and goddesses we are co-creators we are all of that so essentially we 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 came here essentially to taste the ambrosia of planet earth we didn't come here to a lot of people think if you're spiritual you need to be poor no we we are supposed to be having the most expansive existence there is possible and but at the same time we also have to realize that it's all it's all about our inner experience which is important because everything else is the distraction is the illusion a lot of people think that because i have a lot of money i should be and i have a fancy car and i have a nice house and i live in this posh suburb that people should treat me differently you see and when enough people actually become awakened they realize the trick in itself because everything is is equal they're just different polarities in nature but essentially everything is on the same level so i don't care how much money you have i'm not going to treat you any different from the pauper on the street because in essence both of you are energetic forms in a 3d form but a lot of the times we have to look at our relationship to money and realize that money is neither good or bad essentially it's our attitude which defines what it is we can look at even the $5 or the five pound note and what whose face do you see on it you see the queen's face on on it so that means that the queen owns your ass <laughs> it means that many of us as a collective because nobody is an island on planet earth we all move together without others we are nothing so if the collective reality if the consensus re recognize that we don't need money we can just live in a resource based economy where free trade is and bartering is in existence then it will change but a lot of us we're still subject to authority authority is humanity's main religion i'm not just talking of it in the context of having a dogma whether you're christian or you're muslim or all these things i'm talking about authority many of us are still in fear of government and monarchy and all of these things keeps humanity in bondage so when enough people realize that they are the walking currency they empower themselves they free themselves and in essence they realize that 
money does not define them. It's the other way around. They actually give definition to everything in existence because we are powering our reality through our thoughts. Nothing more, nothing less. Infinite waters, diving deep. Stay well, stay healthy. Peace.